Jeremy Lin at point guard for Houston. He's good to see. Well, that time he was flat with it. Look at the Rockets run. This is what they want to do. And that young man can do it, Jeremy, Jeremy Lin. Lin. showing the quickness. He's as quick as a hiccup. And right now the Rockets have out-rebounded New Orleans 7-1. to one, Off to a fast start. A new age. And then he's got to figure out who's going to start. 6-0 run now by Houston. Tyreek Evans, a new face. Throws it away. Jeremy Lin in the open court. He's got riches on the wing. Boy, if you're a point guard, you see those two guys running the court. Parsons and Harden, how can you go wrong? Yeah. Shot clock back at 14 seconds. Drew Holiday seems to be a little discombobulated with this offense. He's made about four or five passes that have been tipped. Or last year was Andrew Bynum, remember? Yeah, I don't know, though, whether this is bad moves uh, right now for Philadelphia. We'll see, because if Wiggins comes out next year, they'll probably have the number one pick. There's Dwight Howard taking Whoa. it inside. That was pretty easy. Dwight makes him stop. Somebody's got to be there on the weak side. There it is again, Dwight Howard with a slam. And Dwight just told Jeremy Lin, throw it up. Yeah. That was a bounce pass, and Dwight was looking for the alley-oop. Those are the types of things that as you play with somebody longer, you get a feel for how they want it. Jeremy Lin. Good shot by Jeremy. Really worked hard on his shot in the offseason. Well, he finished strong. He shot over 40% in the last few months last season, and then he worked really hard on that jumper throughout the summer, and it showed right there. Yeah. It's on the way down. But let's go to look at Jeremy's three first. Here's that ball movement. Jeremy finds himself wide open. So now we go look at the, the Chandler Parsons, and then he gets the ball inside. He's got three guys around him, but jump hook. He's able to get up over those defenders, and this is where he wanted the alley-oop. Uh, Jeremy Lin gave him the bounce pass, but I think Jeremy... This is a great run every year. Right? Great participation from the city of Houston. Going over now to Holiday. Trying to get it inside. Ball deflected. Turnover. Rockets look for the run. Lynn takes it back to Harden. Nice little fake to get him inside. Thought he had Anthony Davis goes out. So we'll... Uh, Maybe see him later. I don't know. There's Holiday looking inside. And uh, that shot had no shot. On that alley -oop pass. Yeah. Dwight, he can get it if you just throw it up there. It's more oops than Allen. <laughs> Holiday puts it up. Misses. And it's there. You're not going to get that up. Oh, okay. That time he did. And he hit the floor again. He's a little different big man, though. He's Jason Smith. Whistle and a timeout on the court, 225 left to play in the first half. And Jeremy Lin puts two, nine Rockies. Pelicans a lot of credit. Big guys are playing hard as well on the road. And Jeremy What do you call Chandler? Justin Bieber or, or Justin Timberlake? Oh, Timberlake. <laughs> no, he, oh, you're funny. He called him Robin Thick. There's a basket inside by Jeremy Lin. Good move by Jeremy. Reverse. Actually, he called him all three of those names. He said he just picked out the only white guy he knew that was an entertainer. <laughs> nice reverse there by Jeremy Lin. But I'm not sure. And they had dead spots on their floor. Davis puts it up and in. Yeah, I remember Lou Lloyd one year. He kept dribbling on the same spot. Finally, Bill Fitch told him, hey, look, Lou, don't you know where it is yet? Missed it so badly, it went right to Dwight. That was a pass off the corner of the backboard, wasn't it? Oh, was it? Okay. Somebody like James Harden who can do something with it. Oh, yeah. Hey, that ups your assist a lot. Here's Halliday trying to go between two Rockets defenders. Jeremy Lin said, nope, not going to have any of that. And I'll tell you, Demo's getting a lot of assist on balls that <laughs> he's not really meaning to pass, but he's deflecting them off to other shooters. Throughout his whole career, but he looks like he's added something to his offensive game. I think uh, Coach Bonnie Williams is asking him to do a little bit more offensively. T. Jones. More really of a college feel where they can spend more time here at the arena hanging out together. I'm not going to let anybody else in that players' lounge. It's going to be players only. The players love that, Bill. Back to you. Yeah, just.